He is said to be one of the founding fathers of the prophetic movement in South Africa. Apostle J.B. Makananisa has taken a swipe at wannabe prophets who just prophesy without any spiritual inkling and says this has reduced the prophetic ministry to nothing. Uh, I saw people prophesying prophesy. about the president, the president of Zambia. Was Zambia. Uh, the way it is happening now uh, is really boring me. I have to say that. The way it's happening now, this thing will make the church like we are playing. It's like we wait for someone to come out and say, whom who will be president? All of us will It's like this is what is happening. You know, sometimes when you're a prophet, now, it's better prophet. you don't even prophesy, you preach the word of God. You do what God is telling Why you. Why we don't leave prophecy to prophesy? Why are we not leave prophecy to prophesy? Why we don't leave prophecy to prophesy? Why are we not leave prophecy to prophesy? Let's leave pro if you are not a prophet. I was a prophet. And God has not shown you anything. And I'm a demo was all one No, it's all a little more long. Because this is making the church to be like it's a joke. Someone just came out and said, Yes, uh, I want to give you prophecy. I want to tell you uh, prophecy. Go to Zambia. President is going to be Makananisa. President is going to be Makananisa. Makananisa is not even president. Makananisa is president. Because you saw someone say Makananisa, even if you say you come to Makananisa, this is really boring. Now. It is recalled that Prophet Ian Genesis embarrassingly apologized for his failed prophecy on the Zambian elections. Apology has to be tendered because people's hearts are broken. Not only people that uh, believe in my ministry, but also people that uh, believe that you see, this prophecy in Zambia hurt people. Yes, I did behave unchristian in a certain way. That's why I'm, I'm even apologizing for certain things I did because they were unchristian. I put the prophecy as if it was a bet. You understand? That was unchristian. A lot of things were unchristian. And I take full responsibility of those statements, those things I said. That is what was hurting people. He says prophets have a responsibility to wait on God to receive a message. You have got many well-known ones. Someone just come out and say, yes, who is a prophet? Who is a, who, who is going to be a prophet? And it never happened. Why don't we wait for God to tell us? Why is like the, the, the main issue now? It's all about the issue of preaching the gospel. Is who prophesy who? who? He added that the name prophet has been abused by many, especially Christians. People, Christians. I'm not talking about people who are not Christians. Christians are the ones who are insulting Christians. You stand up and say, God says this and this. And this. They say you are stupid. God didn't send you. But, but you find someone just come and lie and say, you know, there's going to be rain, no rain. We wait for rain, no rain. We wait for rain, no rain. For rain, no rain. For rain, no rain. I think uh, we are abusing the name called prophet. Prophets, we have prophets, true prophets. Other God has not even revealed them and is going to reveal them. We, we have prophets. The leader of the Charis Ministries International advised preachers against prophecies concerning death. I, I think I can tell also the prophet, please let's stop this prophecy of whom, whom is going to die. This prophecy, this prophecy is not a good prophecy. Well, if you have not seen that, allow prophets to see that. Prophets, Prophets, when they say this will happen, it will happen. Says, to Yourself, you know, you, like many people, they will see me losing weight. Now I'm gaining weight now because no, I'm eating now. Gain, you know, you so now I cannot fast now. I if, I, if I fast now, I'm dying. I fast now, I'm dying. Yeah, I saw Makaranisa dying. He's prepared to go 
and then oh, prepare out some Maya and Christmas says yes God must bring the younger ones who told you I'm old I'm of your age when I die you must die too I'm of age when I die you must die too I'm of your age when I die you must die too Somebody say this man is very old. Uh, uh, how old am I? What about yourself? When you know it's so it's, it's so boring. I'm using the word so that you understand. It's yeah, boring. Yeah, boring. It's really boring. I just, it, it really affects the church in it a very wrong way. 